Is it possible to convert muscle fibers? How much? 10%? 50%? Different athletes use different muscle groups, but they also need different muscle fiber composition. For example, two types of runners. A sprinter will primarily train his fast twitch fibers. These react instantly and work super fast, but quickly run out of power. When trained, fast twitch fibers naturally become big and heavy. On the other hand, a marathoner uses mostly his slow twitch fibers, not as reactive and speedy as their fast twitch brothers, but they can work nonstop for hours. Even when trained, these fibers remain slim and light. Some weightlifters might find massive benefit from converting their lean, fatigue-resistant fibers into thick, fast-twitch muscle fibers. Now, for our purposes, the human body naturally shifts away from fast-twitch fibers as it ages, which leads to frailty. And like she said, it occurs to everybody. It starts, you know, even the best one of us. So Terminator here and 007 James Bond. Dirty Harry, you name it. So it occurs to everybody. But if a biohack can preserve or shift muscle fiber composition, we could learn a lot more about the connection between our explosive muscle cells aging and how to manage that balance.